Hello my YouTube fans, welcome to my channel, Inspire Strength here. Uh, today I'm going to show you, uh, well, my routine actually on how I wash my hair, uh, the things that I do before I wash it actually. So what has been done before right now while it's in a protective style is that uh, this morning I really really oiled it very nicely with my uh, DIY oil treatment that I've already show, ha have a video up for. And then I just made a braid in the back, right here. Made two of them. That's just to help my hair to grow a little bit uh, faster, so I have it like that. And then the side I was having, uh, also uh, it wasn't growing as quickly, so I start braiding it just to you know help me to to make it grow a little bit uh, faster. Right now I'm just gonna take it out. Like this. I think that was a braid. It could have been a twist. I'm not sure what I did. Did something. Time. See, I'm just, just unraveling it here. It wasn't uh, growing as quickly, and sometimes you find yourself where the hair breaks off. A really good trick is to oil it liberally, and then make a braid, and just tuck it on the other hair, and just leave it. The less uh, manipulation that happens to it, the better. See, I'm just taking the braid out. I've noticed a really big, big difference. Now, since tonight is my wash day for my hair and to really deep condition it I just wanted to see you to see what I'm doing and how I do that so like I told you this morning I generously oiled my hair you can see that it's really really well that well oiled you touch see that's all from this morning early around six o'clock now it's really late at night so what I do with this treatment, because it's been a while since I've done my egg treatment, right now it's, it's getting to be winter here, and because of the cold weather, uh, my hair is getting uh, a bit dry and brittly from the, uh, the egg treatment. So I stopped that for about, you could say, maybe three weeks, and I only deep condition with the Tresemme conditioner and oil. So now, today, for the first time in like three weeks, I'm actually having an egg into it, as well as everything else you see here. So, let's get started. I'm gonna crack the egg, because I only need the egg yolk. If you want your, if your hair is oily, you can use egg white. If it's dry, like mine, then you need the egg yolk. I've got a clear container here. I'm just gonna pour the yolk in. That's finished. Like that. And I don't need any more oil because that's already done. And then I'm going to take my Tresemme conditioner. I think you can see that. This is um, Tresemme Remoisturizer conditioner. And I'm going to use that generously, a generous amount, into this container here. So I'm just going to pour. See if we can get down. There we go. Wow. Good job. A generous amount because I am going to leave this in my hair for a bit. I think I can add a bit more to that. That should be good. Okay. There we go. And just put that down. This is just a chopstick that I have that I really love a lot. And I just paint it red with red nail polish here because I use it to stir and mix things with. There you go. Nice. Just makes it a lot easier for me when you have things separated from what you use in the kitchen or what you use in your hair. Yeah. See, this is what it's supposed to look like when it's all done. And then we're going to apply this mixture to your hair a generous amount. So I'm just going to start from the back. I'm going to take the braid out that I have in the back. But I didn't want to touch them until I add the extra moisture to it, and then I can start open. And that way you don't lose hair. And the best way to not lose your hair is to wet it before you do anything. Unless, of course, you're going to do um, like a, a bantu knot or something like that. But when it comes to conditioning your hair, you want to make sure that you add moisture and liquid to your hair as much as you can. Please excuse my hand, I know it was up for a bit and you couldn't really see what I was doing, but now I'm just taking out the braid that's in the back. And I do that every day. 
it really really helped the back of my hair to grow because I don't have to do anything to it I just oil it generously make a braid and put her up in a bun excellent excellent you can't imagine how much my hair grew I, I, I actually think it grew two inches long just in like what I think two months because it was so fast even I was stunned I, w I was really 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 pleased about that and I just generously add your conditioner deep conditioner to it see nice homemade cholesterol treatment for your hair perfect look at that you know you buy this in the store it's filled up with so many so much chemicals and other things into it things you can't even read this you know it's just conditioner a nice egg egg yolk into there and you're gonna leave it on for 30 minutes if you wish oh and it's a bit messy but really not much right here generous mouth and more I just add some more to the middle because I can feel that it needs it right there 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 we go and I'm just going to add the rest of it to my hair because I just want to add it as liberally as I can and all over everywhere so this is what I do every week um, like I said, today is the first time in three weeks that I'm using the egg treatment again. i just been doing the deep condition treatment just for uh, just uh, to re-moisturize my hair because now it's winter here. And I want to make sure it gets nice and soft again. Wow. I've always liked doing this. It, it is such a good thing. I mean, like, it just makes my hair feel, I can just feel already how soft it is. I'm always, always amazed at that. And one thing I have to tell you is make sure you don't leave this egg uh, treatment in your hair too long because then the egg will start to, if you will, cook. It'll be like when you look, you'll see little bits of pieces of egg white into your hair, you know, that, that is um, from the heat. So you don't want that. I don't leave this on very long. I leave it on for like 30 minutes, the most. Less less yes but not more because you really don't want to have the mess my daughter will take it out of my hair for me which is quite nice but <laughs> I don't think it's something that she gets she thinks is really really very nice so I'm almost done right now and then to just keep it for the 10 minutes I told you about I'm just gonna like put a plastic cap over it plastic bag and then just leave it like this for a bit. Oh, I want to show you the back seat. Look, do you see that? Okay, I can do that. Not because it's it's wet, but even if your hair is wet and moisturized like mine, and you're able to shake it like that, I'm getting that result exactly from eggs. And I told you guys on so many of my other videos, please, 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 Eat your eggs. Have eggs once or twice a week if you're not used to it. If you if it's not in your regime, but if really if it isn't if if it's something that you you're not allergic to and you can handle, one a day is the best thing. It really really will help your hair a lot to be much more manageable to be soft. I I I just oh, I just really really want to emphasize that to you guys, and then. Just to get back to my point about this morning, I told you I oiled it first. The reason for that is because I want to make sure. The reason for that is because I want to make sure that the air, the hair will stay moisturized and stay really, really, really um, soft, and not overstripped by the uh, the egg. So, anyway, like I said, you can put a plastic bag if you like. I'm not gonna really do it now because I don't need to. I, I, I honestly don't always do that. I just take my scrunchie and this is what I do. I'm gonna show you. 
I'm gonna show you because anything I can do to make taking care of my hair easier and easy, that's exactly what I do. So when I show you something, I want you to know that I am doing it. I am actually following that regime with my hair and taking care of it that way. I'm not gonna put the plastic bag because then it gets really hot, really sweaty, and then I don't like that. So I'm more comfortable when I just leave it like this and I'm good. And even when I'm gonna wash this out, I just go in the shower, literally, wash my hair like normal, wash my body, that's it. Not a big, big deal. Because you know what? You want to make sure your hair is not so much of a headache and so much work. You know, take your time, you're gonna enjoy what you do, enjoy taking care of your hair, but if you become stressed with it, it's not worth it. So, I want to make your life a lot easier, I want to make your life stress-free, and the best way to do that is, like I, sh I showed you, how I, what I'm doing. So, next 10, 15 minutes, 30 tops, I'll be rinsing it out, and then, that's it, in the shower. So anyway, this is my routine for my deep condition for the hair. And uh, if you like this video, and would like to see more of it, I'd like to give it a, please a thumbs up. Love you guys, and I'll see you very, very soon. And please, hey, don't forget to subscribe. Love you, bye.